With Ipswich and Barnsley dropping points, victory in their last home game against Birmingham was absolutely critical. Robert Taylor bearing down on Darren Purse. Can he take it all the way through? It's fallen for Sean Gota! Ball locks the taker. Jobson was in there. And Taylor! And the man who almost denied Manchester City promotion a year ago with Gillingham this year puts them a step closer to the Premiership. And Furlong got the touch, and Adebola almost got away from Jobson and still gets his shot in. Edgehill in trouble against Lazaridis. Oh. But City would hang on to their 1 0 win. And Manchester City are almost there. Joe Royal's team are one point away from securing a return to the Premiership. And although they appealed for fans not to come onto the pitch, there was a natural explosion of jubilation at the end. They are so delighted having been through so many troubled times here that they're on the brink of getting back to the Premiership that as a natural outpouring of celebration they have just raced onto the main road turf. Richard, amazing scenes, you look somewhat shell-shocked I've got to tell you. Well that's right, um, obviously um, promotion hasn't been secured yet, we need another point. Um, you know the supporters have had bad times over the years and they're getting a bit carried away. But uh, you know we've got to try and keep a feet on the ground and obviously it's going to go to the last game next week against uh, Blackburn. For the final game at Ewood Park the fans travelled in their thousands to see if the dream would finally turn into reality. City wouldn't blow this, would they? Are City going to do it today? No problem, no problem. 2-0, they'll do it. We've got to be positive. Yeah, no problem. We're going to do it, mate. Big time. Big, Big time. time. No problem. Hey, we're just like, we're, we're, we're back where we want to belong. We're going to win 3-1. Sean Golson will get two, and Paul Dickoff will get one. It was an extraordinary game. Here's Janssen! Goal! And that really has put the cat among the pigeons. Blackburn would hit the woodwork four times, but after years of despair, Fortune finally decreed that it would be City's day. Here's Kennedy. Warlock has made a great run here down the channel, in towards Dickoff and Gota! <laughs> Daly here has to be careful, and he's given them a goal! Dickoff here looking to secure a win, and Kennedy probably has done. Joe Royal takes the acclaim from the goal scorer who's run half the length of the pitch to celebrate with his manager. And here's Dickoff. And he's gone all the way through! Terry Hilborn blows the final whistle and Manchester City have completed the climb back to the Premiership. A second successive promotion, Joe Royal getting an instant bottle of champagne and four years and two days after they played their last Premiership match, Manchester City are back there. They're back in the promised land. For all you've achieved in football, Joe, is this your proudest moment? At the moment, it's fantastic. You know, back-to-back -back promotions, and particularly the size of the club, and when you see the fans that we've got, the, the fans were amazing today. Um, they nearly killed me in the end. They were squashing me to death, but uh, they were fantastic. And, and the Premiership deserves Manchester City as much as Manchester City deserves the Premiership. So City back in the big time just two years after reaching their lowest ebb. And Manchester will be treated to at least three derbies this season. The team.